I didn't have any brown paper, so I'm going to be using a brown paper grocery store bag. And we're going to trace the body of the turkey with the cups. Okay, so we're going to trace the cup and the plate to make the body of the turkey. I'm going to go around. You can do it separate and then do the small circle and the big circle and glue it together. Or if you put them together like this, you're going to have a little turkey. So it's up to you. You can do big plate by itself and then you can do the small cut and you're going to have two different circles and then we'll just glue the circles together later so however you prefer and now we're going to cut okay. a little turkey and then we go around and I'm going to go like that because I want to together so if we want them together we go from the big circle to the little circle <coughs> sorry we are a little sick in the house at the moment And then we're gonna turn it around. When we glue it, we'll turn it around so we don't see all the little lines. Yellow paper, we're gonna make the beak. And the easiest way is just grab a little corner, snap. And then we're gonna have a little beak for the turkey. And then in the white paper, what we're gonna do is we're gonna put glue, a big giant circle of glue we're going to put the leaves and then we're going to glue the turkey on top and we're going to do a little beak and we're going to draw a little ice and whatever other decoration you want to put on your turkey it's going to have a <coughs> back <coughs> sorry okay. it's going to have a back set of feathers made out of leaves from our walk so this is what one of the turkeys is going to look like. Here are the leaves that we collected during our walk that we're going to be gluing to our paper. Not yet, not yet. Okay, we're gonna make a big circle of glue. Put glue all over the place. Wait. And you're going to put the leaves Wherever the glue is, okay? Okay. Put all the leaves. These are going to be the turkey feathers. Be all the turkey feathers. Come on, put some more feathers. Put some more leaves for turkey feathers. Mm. How about this one? Yes. Mm hmm Good job. Put more. Look, there's glue right there. Here's this one. Okay, now that we have all of our feathers glued down, you can either put Mud Podge on top or just let it be like this, I'm going to grab the little turkey and put glue on the little turkey. We're going to put it here. Now we have, I'm going to fix one of these feathers over here so it looks more like a okay. tail. Now we have a little turkey and we're going to put the beak that we cut out over here. You can cut out a waddle too if you'd like. You can cut out little legs, but I am going to get a marker and put some ice. Okay, 
I just grabbed a normal Sharpie marker. You can grab a different marker or if your little one is old enough, they can make their own little eyes on the turkey. Or if you have eyes, yes. Or if you have googly eyes, that would look really cute on the turkey too. And here we go. It is a fun Thanksgiving turkey. We did an outing after a few days of rain. We needed to get out of the house, so we went hunting for feathers. Now we used them in a fun Thanksgiving craft. I didn't have any brown paper, so I'm gonna be using a brown paper grocery store bag. And we're going to trace the body of the turkey with the cups. 